forget the Joe Bros. Super classic. <gasps> oh my god. This is literally insane. Just loading up the car, getting ready to go to Wisconsin. Yeah, tell them what we're doing today, Liz. We are playing a drive-in concert. So it's kind of like a drive-in movie, but we are on the stage instead of the movie, and we perform for a bunch of cars of people. We don't know how it's gonna be. Like, are people going to sit outside, like on the cars? Are they gonna be instead of a car? <laughs> yeah, what do we say on stage? Like, we're not totally sure. But it's a beautiful day. So we are gonna be opening for our friend Tom from the band Plain White Tees. And we're gonna be driving out to Wisconsin with Tom. So we're here, we're waiting, uh, and we're getting ready to leave. I mean, I'm excited. We're gonna be playing live music again. There's gonna be people. Online concerts and live streams are fun, but there's something cool about like being able to look at the people that you're playing for and seeing their reactions, and seeing them sing along and all that stuff. So it'll be fun. Sound check. Here's our venue for the night. You guys, we just found out that the lot is sold out for the night. Already regretting my outfit decision. It's currently like 70 degrees and it's going to be down to like 50 degrees. I told her to wear pants, guys. <laughs> I told like her pants. to wear pants. Yes, you do. That's like a babe. No matter what you wear. Oh, we don't have any blankets in the car or anything. sound check and the backstage area for the show is literally insane. It's um, a building owned by one of the owners of the Milwaukee Bucks NBA team and there's all kinds of like cool sports memorabilia. There's show posters like this Bruce Springsteen one. There's so much cool stuff. It's like on some sides you have cool music stuff like Elton John's record autographed Billy Joel poster and then on the other side. Jonas Brothers grave. Don't forget the Joe Bros. Super classic. And then you got a Kobe jersey over here. It looks like an all-star jersey. Bunch of football helmets. This place is insane. <gasps> oh my god. Lizzie found something she likes. Hi, I'm Taylor, it says. <laughs> this is insane. It's like everywhere you turn. They got beads, they got Elton, Garth Brooks, Michael Buble. Gonna be a Fairview poster up there someday, guys. This is what we need in the Humans Were Here studio. You're just, you know, you're recording a great guitar track, and all of a sudden you're working on the short game. I mean, this place is paradise. It's incredible. What's in this room? Oh, it's just a bunch of autographed guitars. Huh. And in here they have a bunch of amazing Milwaukee Bucks stuff. And actually, we were at the Milwaukee Bucks arena last year for the Panic at the Disco Pray for the Wicked tour. So we like Bucks. I mean, I like the Bucks. We're from Chicago, we love the Bulls, whatever, but the Bucks are pretty cool. This thing looks wild. I don't even know, I mean, it's like a simulator. It's not a camp, they need oxygen, so I'm gonna leave this 
So thank you to everybody from uh, Wisconsin who came out. It was a sold out show and it was just awesome to be playing to people. Everybody sat outside their cars even though it was really cold outside. It was the first show I think we played since March? February. February? It felt good. It did. It really did. It was also really cool to contribute to the two charities that all the proceeds went to. Camp Hometown Heroes and Camp Reunite. Camp Reunite reunites kids with their parents who are in prison and just from what we heard about the organization they take like a weekend and they have all these kids go down and they get to see their moms and they like wave a lot of the rules as far as letting them hug their parents and just spending this whole weekend with them so it seems like such an awesome organization the other one is camp hometown heroes the money goes to help children who have lost a parent in the military so it's giving back to the children of people who have paid the ultimate sacrifice so thank you to everybody in Wisconsin. Hopefully we can do this again in some other states and cities around the country. So we'll see. We definitely want to put together another online concert and um, we will see you guys soon. Bye.